Okay, I'm back in a minute, believe it or not. I'm in the garage now because nighttime came and there was a bunch of wind. And, well, you know how that goes. So, putting the slats in, what I did was I've got um, angle iron half by half. And I'll show you um, the pieces if I can find them. They're around here somewhere. A bunch of crap. No, that's not it. I knew I brought them, I brought them up here somewhere. Oh yeah, here we go. So then I used the plasma cutter again to just chop off about an inch of this half by half angle iron. And then uh, I uh, put the slats on and, and just welded them on each side to hold them in place. Now, uh, it seems to be, uh, you know, I have to build up this the eighth of an inch to keep everything flush, but uh, it seems to be a really stable, stable base. And when the slats get ugly, you just flip them over. And then cut the other side. And then when they get ugly again, I'll uh, make some new ones. I think this inch and a half by inch and a half by eighth by 20 feet was like $10. So you know, I can get a bunch out of that. I can get six slats out of that $20 piece. Ten dollar piece. I mean, I think it was ten dollars. Anyway, the whole, all the metal I bought for this whole thing was a hundred dollars, and I, I have two pieces of, uh, I have a twenty foot piece of angle iron that I'm probably not going to use, and another ten foot piece of this half inch, which I probably will use. Again, you know, I'm going to have to grind some of this stuff off. It's not pretty, but it's going to work, and I'm really excited. To see what we can make with this, or what I can make with this uh, plasma cutter right there and the uh, Eastwood MIG 175, which is performing as best as it can considering the operator. So um, that's about it so far. Fairly stable. I'm having trouble with the wheels because uh, they're not secure enough, so I'm gonna have to come up with something else. Anyway, minor inconvenience. And also, just for gee whiz stuff, have again my uh, Harbor Freight bender for uh, bending parts. Haven't tried it yet, but uh, I'm sure I will. So, um, this was my canopy. That's my machine. That's my utility cart. And this is my welding slant. Um, plasma cutting table. I'm very excited. Okay, I'll be back with part three, hopefully tomorrow, and it should be done, and then we'll go from there. Bye-bye.